you're a Sprint subscriber, we did you a big favor. We took all of these Sprint phones and whittled them down to five chosen ones. This is the top five Sprint phone countdown for InfoSync World. Arriving at number five, we have the HTC Arrive, and this is Sprint's first Windows Phone 7 phone. Now this has a slide-out QWERTY keyboard that angles up to meet your eyes. The Arrive also sports a modest 3.6 inch WVGA screen, but it's got 16 million colors. The Arrive has a 5 megapixel camera with LED flash, and it has 16 gigabytes of built-in NAND storage. In our tests, the Arrive was one of the best call quality phones that we've seen. However, this thing is a bit of a cult classic. It belongs within the Rocky Horror genre of smartphones in that it really only caters to a specific type of user. If you've got an affinity for Windows Live, Hotmail, Xbox, Zune, Office, or Mr. Gates himself, then the HTC Arrive is definitely worth taking a look at. Flipping out at number four, we have the BlackBerry Style, and we say flipping out because this thing flips up to reveal a full QWERTY keyboard. Architecturally, this phone's a bit of a black sheep within the smartphone market. We love the BlackBerry style because of new BlackBerry 6 OS, and its camera was one of the best we've seen even compared to the cell phone entertainment giants like the Droid X. Call quality and battery life are superb on the BlackBerry style, and it's a solidly built phone. Besides, who could live without BlackBerry Messenger? Occupying the third slot in our countdown is the Samsung Epic 4G, and it's part of the Samsung Galaxy S constellation, in our mind, it is the brightest star. When you compare it to the Samsung Captivate or the Vibrant, it has a front-facing camera, slide-out QWERTY keyboard, it's got 4G connectivity, and it's got an LED flash for the 5 megapixel main camera. These are traits that you can't find on any of the Galaxy S phones that were released last year. The Samsung Epic 4G is a speed racer with a 1 GHz Hummingbird processor. It runs Android 2.2, and it has full support from the Android market. Even compared to the recently reviewed Samsung Galaxy S 4G, we prefer the Epic 4G. It's just the best. Sliding in at number two is the little brother to one of the most popular phones on the market. This is the HTC Evo Shift 4G, and this is our top road warrior phone for obvious reasons. It's ideal for traveling, multitasking, battery life and call quality were good. Also, image quality on this phone was surprisingly decent, including 720p. We have a slide-out QWERTY keyboard, Android 2.2, and HTC Sense. The HTC Evo Shift 4G is geared toward those looking for more of a productivity and travel warrior compared to an entertainment giant. And speaking of entertainment giants, it's time for our number one Sprint phone, obviously the HTC Evo 4G. When it was released over a year ago, the phone was ahead of its time and it's still topping lists to this day. We've got an obscene 4.3 inch 65,000 color display, a front facing camera, kickstand, HDMI terminal, Android 2.2, an 8 megapixel camera with LED flash, and there are no bones about it. The HTC Evo 4G is a code red threat to most phones on the market. We know the new HTC Evo 3D is coming out this summer, but if you need a phone right now, the best Sprint has to offer is the HTC Evo 4G. This has been our top 5 Sprint countdown. For the reviews to all of these phones and more, go to www.infosyncworld.com. Until next time, I'm Mike Perlman.